Hello? Hi, is this Heather? Uh, yeah, this is me. Hey, Heather, my name is Dale. I think you're my son's fifth grade teacher. His name is Anthony. Oh, yeah. Hi. How are um, you? It's nice to meet you. I don't think we've ever actually met before. No, we haven't. Right? No, uh-uh. Right. No, I thought yeah. I'd just give you a call today to talk about some stuff if you have a minute. Oh, sure. Yeah, I do. I'm calling you because of a situation that happened recently. Okay. And it doesn't have anything to do with Anthony, and it wasn't even at school. I'm sorry. I'm a little bit confused. Well, let me clear that up for you. <laughs> I was out last weekend at my favorite bar. It's called Sp and I'm pretty uh -huh. sure I'm pretty sure that I saw you there. Yeah, I. Yeah, I've, mm -hmm. I I know that bar very well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, this particular night, you got up and danced around on a pole that they had set up there, like in a pole dancing competition. So, am I right? Oh my god. Um, yeah. <laughs> I thought that was yeah. you. That's crazy. But Crazy. That's kind of embarrassing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, imagine my surprise when I'm sitting there and then my son's fifth grade teacher is up dancing on I'm, a pole in front of everybody. Yeah. That's not what I, yeah. It uh, wasn't one of my prouder moments. So, you know, maybe I had too much to drink, probably. <laughs> it definitely. looked like you, hey, it looked like you were having fun. I'm not worried about it. Okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's still, I'm not, still I'm not, pretty embarrassing. I'm not calling to try to get you in trouble or anything. Okay. okay. I'm not, you know, it's we all have our own lives, but, <laughs> yeah. you know, it's just... Yeah, I mean, it looked not, like... Not a good moment. It looked like you were having a blast on that pole. I mean, I've never seen anybody work a pole with that kind of passion. <laughs> okay, well, this is now kind of a little bit awkward, a little bit weird. You go to those pole dancing classes... Or is that just something that comes no, naturally? I, no, I haven't. Um, that's actually now the, I'm sorry, the conversation now has turned inappropriate. So if you'd like to speak about Anthony, um, then we definitely can, but... Um, sorry about that, but I, yes, I do want to talk about Anthony real quick. Okay. Okay. Now, I hate to bring it up again, but I have to for the story. So after I saw you doing the pole dancing thing, when I got home, I just, I couldn't stop thinking about what I saw, so I ended up telling my son Anthony all about it. I'm sorry, What? I ended up telling my son about how I saw you dancing on the pole at this bar. Why would you do that? I, I don't know. I just couldn't stop thinking about it. And he was there. He was awake when I got home. And I said, dude, you're not going to believe what I saw. And I started telling him about it. And he didn't even know what pole dancing was. No, of course not. He's 10 years old. Yeah. And I, I, I had to show him some video. I showed him some YouTube videos. Okay. I'm sorry. This is uh, This conversation has... I don't, I don't like this. Um, if you'd like to speak to me about school business, then I can do that. This is about school. Um, this is definitely about school. How is this about school? The only thing you're talking about is seeing me at the bar pole dancing. Right. How is this, how is this translate to anything about school? Because I need you to sit down with him and tell him a little bit about, more about pole dancing. He's just got so many you questions. No, what? He's no. got, he, he's got so many questions he'd love to ask you. No, I, no, that's, inappropriate but you're a teacher yeah i am a school teacher right but you still want to help your students learn right okay that is not something that i am here to teach your son you don't have to go into i just you need to tell him why you would pull that like what it is about pole dancing that you like maybe about how no, he could do is, it no that's not a conversation i'm gonna have with a 10 year old do you feel sexy when you do it like those are the okay, kind of things he wants I'm, to know those are not questions that he wants to know Answer two. No, those are. He, that's what he asked me. He said, why does she pole dance? And I said, I don't know. Maybe it helps her feel sexy. Does it help you? You should not be having this conversation with your son. You're right. I can't have this conversation with him because I don't know enough about pole dancing. But you are clearly a pro and you know how this stuff works. No, I no. Don't... Stop it. No. Okay, well, I'm going to have to call the school district and let them know what I saw then. I'm not going to be blackmailed by you because I'm not going to sit down with your son and talk about pole dancing. Now, I'm going to hang up this phone and forget that we ever had this conversation. Well, before okay? you do, I should probably tell you that this is a prank phone call. Seriously? This is actually Jubal from Brook and Jubal in the morning doing a phone tap on you. <laughs> Shut up. No way. Your friend Matthew set you up. He told us about the pole dancing. Oh, my 
my God. <laughs> he said he thought you'd be really embarrassed if a parent called you up to talk about it. So <laughs> I hear you did a good job, though, if that helps. <laughs> okay, well, that I don't want to talk about And that. I would be willing to come watch and critique anytime. So you know. I'm good. I'm, I don't think that's going to happen again. <laughs> you sure? I am real sure. All right.